Well, Carl, the NFL is the most valuable advertising on TV. It's also typically the highest rated content, with viewership making gains over the past two seasons after a few seasons of declines. So a lot of money is at stake as broadcasters and advertisers watch the season kickoff and hope that games don't have to postpone or cancel. Now, to give you a sense of the money at stake, last year, nearly $3 billion was spent on advertising during the NFL regular season. That's a total of about $175 million spent per week. Another $271 million was spent during the playoffs, and over half a billion dollars was spent on ads for the Super Bowl. Now, those ad dollars impact all of the media companies, with games on NBC, CBS, Fox, ESPN, and the NFL Network. And despite the uncertainty and more competition for viewers with the NHL and NBA also playing, CBS Sports Chairman Sean McManus tells us, quote, sales are very brisk. We're actually pacing at the exact level we paced at last year. And last Last year was an incredibly successful year for us. Super Bowl sales have been active. Now, with this kind of advertiser demand, NFL rights deals, which expire starting after next year's season, are expected to be even more valuable. Analyst Michael Nathanson says, quote, we are assuming gigantic increases for the upcoming cycle of new NFL contracts. We expect the current slate of Sunday rights to be retained by CBS, NBC, and Fox, with a base case assumption of a 75 percent increase in average cost. Now, as as for what happens if games are canceled this fall, CBS tells us advertisers can choose to reallocate those dollars or take them back. And Deirdre, if the games are delayed, the ads are just delayed along with them.